Bangladesh inaugurates its first nuclear power plant in a virtual ceremony attended by Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina and Russian President Vladimir Putin. Putin praised 50 years of relations between the two countries. Bangladesh is our tested ally and partner. Our relationship is built on the basis of mutual respect, equality and benefits. But the project comes with many challenges. Bangladesh has been struggling to cope with inflation, power cuts and rising energy costs. And after borrowing more than $4 billion from the International Monetary Fund, the lender is raising questions over the country's foreign currency reserves, bad loans and a high inflation. Nuclear power is seen by some as potential way out. This more than $12 billion project comes with geopolitical toll as well as financial challenge. But this is a flagship project. With US and European sanctions barring Russia from much of the international banking system, Bangladesh is reported to have for the plan using Chinese yuan. The geopolitical toll here is essentially the currency uh, of payment uh, to Russian sources. So therefore, alternative currency will also become a major geopolitical game play uh, for the government in due course of time. So therefore, the government has to be very, very careful. The first consignment of uranium arrived in Dhaka from Russia last Thursday by a special air cargo plane. The following day, it was moved to a nuclear power plant site 200 kilometers west of Dhaka by road under heavy security. Construction delays, high cost and public fears about nuclear safety and managing the plant's waste are also growing. One of the uh, important aspects of uh, decarbonization is nuclear power. Because, you know, rene renewable energy, whatever we say, is really not that powerful enough at this moment, especially for developing countries, which do not have enough land. So we may have to depend more on uh, sort of uh, nuclear power and sort of renewable import. Russia and the United States rivalry may pose a test for Dhaka's policy of neutrality, but it seems determined that won't stop it moving forward with nuclear power. Make sure to subscribe to a channel to the latest news from RDZ World News.